so I just finished a walkthrough video though video though video of this place and this time I'm gonna metal detect it I'm gonna try to take my time not get frustrated by the massive amounts of gravel underneath my feet underneath this grass or the mosquitoes or anything else that could go wrong in this video it's actually just kind of what I'm doing I don't always find incredible treasures but when I'm wearing the Randolph Relic Recovery charm I get a 79 or 80 I'm hoping it is a shiny pull tab I'm gonna do this no matter what this is I am sending it to Martin. Watch it be the world's rarest. Oh my gosh, I don't want to send this to Martin. Look at that. I want to keep it. What is that? I'm going to send it to you. Look at that. has a finial and furb it is brass hey baby i don't know what it is it looks like a a music leer thing from many a moon ago it is brass i nicked it i'm on my brow check it out look at that that's my first hole i just committed I just committed to giving this. <laughs> I just found another hole. I just committed to giving this to Martin. I said no matter what I dig, it's going to go to Martin. Because I'm using my Randolph Relic recovery. What is it, a handle? I, I don't know if it's a handle, but it's, it's kind of got the shape of a, a, a music leer thingy. And then after I dug it, I said, I don't want to give it to him because it's so cool. It has like a heart in it or something. I know. I don't want him to have it. What's it what do I do? I don't know. I'll give it to him. <laughs> you want to go? Uh, I got another signal down here, but it could be that shovel. I don't have my man purse. Would you harvest this? Yes, item? I will. Okay, let's go. I got another good signal, darling. Oh, I didn't tell you. On a previous video, I did a walkthrough because I was going to do it all at once, but there was a coyote back there sleeping behind the thing and it just jumped up and tried it off, but there's a hole right here. That's not my hole. We just dug that other signal right over here somewhere because my perfect plug relation. Oh, here it is. That's where I just dug. And my whole relation integrity <laughs> is unsurpassable or is it insurpassable? But there's a 73 right here. Okay, Martin, you cannot have this find. Cannot have it. Maybe the gravel is all up higher. I do a three-point plugulation for multiple reasons. Oh. oh it's, it's a coin. coin. It is, ain't it? You want to decipher? You want to trade? Oh, you got it cleaned off. It's a, a library. Standard issue library? Yeah. It is, ain't it? You sure? Ah, uh, oh, it is. It's a zinc. It's not that old. So we'll give that to Martin, or we send him this. Maybe he won't. Maybe he won't watch the video, and he'll never know the difference. Okay, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna give him that. That is cool, huh? Yeah, I got it to. You can tell where you hit it with the shovel. I didn't do that. I didn't either. 
There you go. <laughs> Next hole. Solid 8081. I think it's a modern dime. Oh, that's fire ants all over my feet. Oh my goodness. I thought there was something just tickling me. But no. Where? Oh, there they are. That's awesome right there. Okay, take a break. Yeah, it's too shallow to be anything else. Although that other thing gave a pretty good signal. The fire ants are right there. They're actually not fire ants. They're little, uh... They're other ants, but they still bite just a little. Three-point plugulation for holation integrity. It lays it. This may be a can. I hope it is. All integrity is gone once you start getting crazy deep. Oh, it's right there. Oh, these ants went up my legs. It's okay though. It's a piece of aluminium. Who's your harvest? Kind of close to the entrance. I got a 78. ish now I forgot what it is I got a feeling it's going to be a large home that's an HOM that's a hunk of metal and I told myself I was not going to dig them If they're that big but we will either way so let's see I'm trying hang on you're getting impatient with me now I'm into the gravel zone I think got to be in there right rather large I'm trying to pick up my shovel it's gonna be a pipe it's gonna be lead it's gonna be that bolt We're ahead. It's nice. So the question is, what is it holding together? Or what was it holding together? Moved over there. Well, then we'll just go over there and dig. They got some stout mosquitoes around here. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm just as frustrated, so bear with me. That's a clavos. I'm thinking the other thing is too.
81, 82. The mosquitoes are big and have a big red spot on them. Especially. Right there. 81, 82. I really wanted to take my time out here today. But the mosquitoes. I'm going to quit saying the word mosquito. Because if you stop talking about them, you just ignore them. They won't. There we go. They won't, uh, they'll go away. Yeah, the 80s was right there on this edge. Trying as hard as I may, as hard as I might. What is it? Okay, this is getting uh, getting kind of hectic. Still on this edge right here. Right there on the edge. Pinpointer is working exceptionally well today for some reason. Almost too good. What is down here in the dirt? We gotta find it together at the same time, right? That is getting kind of crazy. I can't say much of my uh, holation right here. This is going to be a large piece of iron or a really, really, really nice can. This is a can of spam. Or it was. I've got some uh, remediation to do here. Give you a little relation to where I am. I have got so many 5960. I got a feeling it's a pull tab, but you don't know until you dig a hole. I hope it's not. It's not. It is a cap to something, something, something. It's kind of neat. We shall harvest a little further away, a long 70s to 80s. Even though it's only right there now. Before, I got a signal on my detector. Oh, a long way from that spot. It says it's 8 to 12 foot deep. So it should be easy to get. I'm just kidding. This video is not gonna be long. I told you it was long, look. I told you wherever that was, was long and strong. It is a hinge off of something. It's not that old, still got paint on it. So, green side up, baby. A little further away, got a 68 right here. A 
grass is a little prettier here, so we'll work on some hole integrity. We'll do a one. We'll do a two. We'll do a three. Because if you move all the roots from all four sides, you end up with a plug that doesn't seat real well sometimes. It's always a bummer when you dig next to it. Then you gotta do some mangling anyway. Martin taught me how to dig, by the way. He sent me videos on it. So if I'm not doing a good job, find him and tell him. I like that. Perfect. Sixty-three, sixty-four, and the Garrett AT Gold promises me it is a piece of gold. There's a piece of gold right there. Absolutely, a hundred percent. Absolutely right. I'm trying to get closer to this building. The closer I get to the streets, the more junk I dig. This is going to be a piece. gold the ground is so soft that's because we're down in the uh, soft lands Clavos. So let's test it. Huh. <laughs> it's in there. I told you. It's better than gold. Oh, it's embossed. Help. I can't believe it's embossed. This will make an incredible necklace. Pull up. Pull up. Tab pull up. That'd make an awesome necklace. I just found the source of the mosquito habitat. I'm gonna do this town a favor and not even send a bill. Look at all the mosquitoes in the air. Holy smokes, I know you can't see them. Have you ever watched the mosquitoes hatch out of buckets of water? You'll see on their little squiggly things. And then when they're ready to hatch, they go to the top. And they'll just get slower and slower and slower. And I promise you, there may be videos about it. All of a sudden, if you watch long enough, they go whoop. And they're on top of the water and they're standing there with little fingers and their toes and they go Whoa. pretty awesome okay what are we doing over oh, metal detector and i'm wrapping it up over here to the right you have a roman theater over here to the left you have a southern alabama alamo must be a well in there I don't know so I thought we'd look around for a minute before we press on uh, that piece of concrete is broken so don't step there I tell you what would be awesome this winter it was massive amounts of uh, massive amounts of bug spray on it to get in this ditch and look for bottles because whatever industry was here quite possibly 
just tossed everything out back because that's the way people did it for some reason i don't know why i got in these things again though they're pretty awesome what's cool about them is you can wash your clothes and then put your clothes back on and uh, sometimes they'll still be there i wonder what's in there i'll never know so i'm done i guess i'm stuck since i don't edit videos i gotta send that thing to martin he better like it and cherish it and hang it over his bed thanks for watching my videos before we leave this town i want to show you something awesome tell me if you knew he was from here joe lewis world heavyweight champion 37 to 49 Born May 13, 1914, Chambers County, Alabama, died in 81. Buried in Arlington National Cemetery. Isn't that an awesome statue? I wonder if it's like to scale. I mean, I know he wasn't that tall, but I mean like his physique and everything. I got a good buddy of mine. His dad is a, is a stud boxer. Probably still is. Isn't that joker awesome? I wanted you to see this before I left this town. That's cool, isn't it? Thanks for watching my video.